Hi there, everyone. Meteorologist Daniel Grant here in the 9 News Weather Center with your Denver Gazette forecast. Yesterday was a scorcher. 91 officially out at DIA, our first 90 degree day of 2021. And today, once again, is going to be a warm one for a slightly cooler courtesy of a cold front that has pushed across the state. Enjoy some sunshine early on. Temperatures again this afternoon, they're warming up. Back to the mid to upper 80s we go with a chance for a couple of isolated afternoon thunderstorms. Upper 80s around Fort Collins, Longmont, Erie at 80 six with some 70s. All right, maybe that's more like it up into the foothills in Nederland, Idaho Springs and through Bailey. The scattered showers really coming to an end for us early this morning. We'll get a brief break. This is about eight o'clock or so, but by about three, four p.m. Here they go again right around the Denver metro area. I'm not counting on a lot of rain with these thunderstorms. If anything, it's just going to be some gusty winds that push through a better shot for seeing some more widespread activity across our central mountains and then further towards south central Colorado by about 11 p.m this evening. Scattered showers moving out of the state and we'll be left with partly cloudy skies this evening. This ridge of high pressure is really uh, just ramping up as it pushes across the state. This is going to bring us the continued warmth and the drier conditions overall for the next week or so. Isolated storms once again possible on Monday. They'll be few and far between just like today. We hit 92 on Wednesday. We'll start to see the winds kick up quite a bit for the second half of the week. 93 on Thursday and then another Another front rolls through that'll drop us back into the 80s and then right now looking ahead toward next weekend, possibly looking at a few isolated storms. Hope you're able to stay cool out there and enjoy the rest of your day.